here we go. H-Day Spring Event 2021 sold out. If you don't have a ticket, unfortunately, you gotta wait till the next event. Let's go inside. What's going on, everybody? I'm Hannah Bro Jason at H-Day Spring Event 2021. This event is sold out, so if you guys aren't here, it's really too bad, but you're in luck because I'm gonna show you everything almost at the event. I'm gonna walk around the event. It's gonna be point of view, so I'm gonna jump behind the camera. So let's do it and let's have some fun. H day is split up into a couple different areas. This is the main stage area. You can see the stage back there in the background. They got DJ, they got contest, the giveaway cars back there. I'll show you that later. And then they had the VIP section. They got me posted up here with this NSX and a couple of insane looking S2000s. So what I'm gonna do for you guys today is I'm gonna stay behind the camera. I'm gonna do my best to show you guys as much as I can. We will most likely be interrupted quite a few times, but that's gonna be some of the fun of it. Look at these. You're definitely award winners. This car here, funny story, I actually, I have a picture of me standing up on top of the wing of this car. The guy asked me if I do it, I'm like, yeah, why not? It's, it's only a wing, right? What could possibly happen? Good, you? Yeah, good, man. When you have time, let me know. I want to take a picture with you. Yeah, let's do that right now. Type R section. I should say the Type R FK8 section. Hey. And uh, well, I'll show you the video from yesterday. I'll just kind of insert it here because. Day 2021 spring. We have an FK8 section and it is packed with Civic Type R's. There are some Civic Type R's that couldn't make it in this section. They want to park with their friends or what have you. But let me tell you something. The cars that came out are spectacular and they're all modified just a little bit different from each other. And there are some very, very, very special cars that came out, which I'll show you in just a little bit. You can see my hood over there. For the fuel injector clinic bracket classes, XD racing clutch, 1150 index competition, clutch 1050 index, the cylinder supports the 950 index. You have a time trial or qualifier twice today, and you will have first run illuminations also today. A lot of moving kits. Lots and lots of moving kits. Lugia 1320 Sport front wheel drive, Cajun's all wheel drive, JBR engines, Nitro, and the four piston racing all motor. You guys will have your three qualifying sessions today. Look at and one of those very special cars, if you guys haven't seen it online yet, USA 28 Limited Edition Phoenix Yellow, I should say Sunlight Yellow to be correct. 
And this is a this is a Mugen catalog build. Every option that Mugen came out with for this car, this gentleman has. He did not miss anything inside and out. I'll be doing a full review walk around in this car later today. Wow. That's a lot. That, that's too much, but quite a few. <laughs> that's awesome. Oh, 40 days represented. Yeah. 40 we have every days. color represented. That's awesome. 40 every days. aftermarket Somebody part represented. Is it really? All the way from that one. Somebody would told me. I would have gotten asked that man to bring me some cool little pig. What's I'm going on, guys? For a couple of years. Yeah, well, you're good, good, man. How are you? How are you? Good, good, good. It's a replacement carbon fiber. I saw you looking at it. Not a rep. Knock on it. What's up, man? How are you? Thanks, brother. I appreciate that, man. After that, we got the four piston all motor. So they are coming out. What's crazy is this year. They actually are sold. Whoa. They are sold out this year. They sold out capacity. So there are uh, plenty of people, plenty of cars. And they just keep going, huh? This is insane. I am so excited for today. And this, if you guys haven't been to an H day, this is just one little section. Oh, does that look good? That wheel set up, beautiful. Absolutely, look at this. Uh, that one's going to be an interesting one. It was a great turnout last year. Uh, we actually had some of the races that here this weekend were actually here for that last year. Um, I actually did an interview, I believe it was, with Harry Spock. So, uh, great guy. You know, that's good to meet him. I uh, think they're taking a moment and go talk to some of these races too while they're here. You know, they talk about those before. Yeah. 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 Fenders. Nice. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, Definitely eye-catching, it's crazy. So there like I said before guys, I can guarantee you guys will see every single Honda that you love here at H-Day. Doesn't matter what kind of Honda you're into, let me know at the end of the video if there's any Hondas that I didn't show, but I don't even think that's possible. Everything, I mean, Odysseys, CRVs, Civic Type Ks. What is a Civic Type K? Very, very clever. People bring out their bikes, of course. What's going on, guys? How are you? and lots and lots of media. I've never seen, I've never seen so many pictures taken of so many cars, but you're not, see, and you're not gonna see a collection like this anywhere. Honda Acti, you don't see too many of these rolling around. They're getting more and more popular, of course, but Honda's little K truck, nice. This one's beautiful, I saw this yesterday. The bride seats, absolutely gorgeous inside. Oh, I didn't see the bike in the back yesterday. Good, how are you, is this yours? No, no, it's nice, man, it's nice. Very, very cool looking. It's cool because it's a show, but it's also a meet, so people hang out, they bring coolers, they chill. What's going on, guys? What? 
What's up with this? <laughs> What's up, guys? <laughs> so you get you get a little bit of everything in H Day, and the people are just unbelievably cool. They love showing off the cars. They love hanging out. Yes, they do have a Honda Beat. There's a couple of Honda Beats actually that came out today. And in a very soon video, I'm gonna be showing you guys a lot of Honda Beats with a lot of info about this Honda. completely insane the amount of detail that went into this car look at this all suede this interior is just on another level simply spectacular look at this look at this wow absolutely gorgeous And not to be left out, even a TV in the rear hatch, it's beautiful. Man. You see, like I said, a little bit of everything. Actually, I should say a lot of everything, because it goes on and on and on and on and on. Now you guys are going to see a lot of these VIP stickers. We're still in the VIP section. We haven't even gotten to like the car show. These are just VIP cars. You guys can see how many are here. Nice Accord Coupe. Beautiful. That interior, look at this. Absolutely gorgeous. Like the Skittles corner over here. These builds are sick. Good man, how are you guys? Alright oh, guys. I filmed this car a couple of times. Black Panther. It's an incredible build. He's added a lot of really cool stuff to it. 
done the whole interior, which I think looks just outstanding, really matches the exterior very nicely. How are you, brother? Like I said, guys, you could spend, I mean, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be here for five, six, seven hours trying to film and there is so much to see. So many incredible cars, great people to meet. It's just, it, I'm, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say it, it is my favorite event to attend just because of how much stuff there is here and the quality and the people and there's so much to do. You almost need a third day. So I see another car we haven't seen yet. Here's a cross tour. How are you? They brought the cross tour out. So I'm telling you guys, I don't care what Honda you guys think isn't here. It's most likely here. 10th Gen Society came out with their Civics, possibly some Accords. And it's, I mean, to give you guys just a, a grasp here, it goes all the way back, all the way back there, all the way around. and back way beyond there. I'm going to try to get some racers in this video as well. So 9th Gen Society by the 10th Gen Society. And this group is probably the largest group here if I'm going to take a guess. They got four, maybe five rows deep. And they just keep going and going and going and going and going. Envious is here. Virginia chapter, real strong. What's going on, brother? How are you? Good, how are you? I'm good, I'm good. I'm gonna stop the tour for a second and ask you guys what you think of this type of video. Normally I don't do them. Normally I don't just do walk around videos and shows. I'd rather be in the video to point out things and, and look at cars and explain stuff. So let me know what you think so far and then we will continue. Now this is the life. 
hanging out in the golf cart, cruising around the show, got a little shade over my head. Actually, I have to move my car because someone said I was in a fire lane. Oops. <laughs> so everyone here is just waiting to buy a holiday merch. Stickers and lanyards and keychains and they sell a lot of stuff here that they don't sell online so the line is uh, pretty long to wait for it. Then of course Eat Sleep Brace is here. You guys know I love Eat Sleep Brace. Always busy here. There are some insanely fast cars from all over the country that come to race here. And most booths bring out a booth car, which normally is covered in their own products. Good man, how are you? Good, 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 good. What's going on guys? Everyone's got those glasses on today. Everyone's got those glasses on, I love them. I love them. Um, I mean, sure, let me see what you got. What you guys are looking at here is a car that you can actually win. This is an SI, it's almost totally stock. And what's happening is Nice Ones is allowing you guys to win this car for an entry fee of only $50. 69,000 original miles on this. The paint looks absolutely flawless. The whole car looks great. I mean, it looks great all the way around it. Look at this. All the way from Puerto Rico, Faster Motorsports came out to race their car and to show off some of the products they offer. I met up with these guys at the Puerto Rico Honda race events about a year ago. Awesome, awesome group of guys, real knowledgeable. And a new vendor I haven't seen before is JDI. Interesting what they do, they make a keyless start button for older Hondas that don't have keyless starts. So these are just some of the cars they offer and more coming up soon. It's super inexpensive and it works. I saw a 
video on it yesterday, an explanation of how it worked, and I was very, very impressed. It is just incredible the amount of cars that are here. Here's a car I filmed a couple years ago and you guys went crazy. This car is not on bags. This car is static. Carbureted, let's start up here. Carbureted, if you guys haven't seen the whole video, check it out on my Facebook page and the Instagram page. Hey. How are you, brother? Yes. Yeah, I'm amazed, but I'm all Thanks, so this whole back section is where all the racers are, getting the cars ready, doing some last minute tuning, fixing what might be broken. And a lot of them camp out here, so they sleep here throughout the night. And these cars, like I said, these cars that come out are the fastest in the country. Telling you guys, you could spend three or four days walking around and still not see all the cars that showed up today. I know you know it's H day, so it's all Hondas, but man, simply incredible how many people come out. What's up, brother? How are you? What's going on, guys? How are you? No way, get out of here. Nice, man. There's a lot of people that did their first builds. First builds, they got them just barely done and they brought them out, you know? You trailered it here. I've made it to the very end of the lot. This is it, so everything else is this way. I still, still haven't seen all the cars. I mean, just to give you guys another aspect of how large and insane this event is. And back beyond that way is where all the race cars are. That's where the track is. That's where the stage is. That's where the other VIP is. And then the rest of the cars are all here. But 7,500 tickets were sold.
I've learned a couple things here at H-Day Spring 2021. First of all, H-Day is back after a one year hiatus and the people are proud to be here. It is an incredible turnout and everyone has been so unbelievable. Also, I need a camera person. Try to do this on my own. Too much going on. I really need a camera person. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I tried to show you guys something a little bit different, but I hope you had fun. I hope you learned a little bit. And as always, guys, I'm the Honda Pro, and now you're in the know.